Hello everyone. Welcome back to Chemistry 24 into 7 series. In this series, we have been exploring the solution for previous year competitive exam papers. If you are new here, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for notification. Let's move into what's today's question. So this is the question from University of Hyderabad PhD entrance exam 2018. According to this question, this substrate react with tributyl tin hydride in the presence of A, B, N, which produce a product. So here you see there are four options are given. Let's figure out together which one is the correct option for this question. Let's move into the solution. Before moving to the solution, so tributyl tin hydride reagent, we have already discussed about their preparation properties and application in three parts. If anyone missed that video, you can find the link in the description box. So let's move into the our question. So when you take tributyl tin hydride and ABN, which react together, that produce tributyl tin radical. This tributyl tin radical going to react with our substrate. So here you see how this happened. So tributyl tin radical quickly abstract the bromine atom. So resulting that cleavage of carbon bromine bond by homolytically to produce this carbon center radical. So here you see this carbon center radical going to react with alkene. So for that you just start the numbering. So here you see, so this position get number five and this position get number six. So we have already discussed about this radical cyclization reaction. So in radical cyclization reaction in general, the formation of small member ring is always favored when compared to the larger ring system. Where this, this radical going to attack the fifth position by 5XO trick cyclization, which produce this radical intermediate. So here you should note it down the stereochemistry. So here you see this group present at the top phase so therefore, this radical attack also takes place by top phase which leads to generate this radical intermediate. So now you see, so this group present at the top phase. So now you see this radical going to react with alkyne. So for this you just start the numbering. So just like our previous case, so here also the formation of small ring system is favored when compared to the larger ring system therefore so here also this radical react with this fifth position by 5xo tick cyclization which leads to generate this radical intermediate so here also you should note it down the stereochemistry so now you see this alkane part present at the bottom phase so resulting that this radical attack takes place by bottom phase which leads to generate this radical intermediate. Now you see this part present at the bottom phase. So now you see this radical quickly abstract the proton from tributyl tin hydride which leads to generate this product. See this radical cyclization takes place by cascade manner. So let's move into the our question. So as per our discussion, among the four answers, the correct option for this question is answer one. That's it for today's problem. I hope this explanation has helped to understand this question. If you enjoyed this video, just give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe. Kem or Kem. And finally, thanks for watching. Bye bye.